All right, so I'm gonna show you what happens to my Whirlpool microwave that has the touchscreen LCD panel on the front. This microwave is already a year and a half, and I know this is actually Wi-Fi supported and normally gets updates automatically. And I also have the Whirlpool stove as well with a touchscreen as well. And the countertop, the top of the glass, it sucks. All right, this is not ceramic. This is glass. It says they claim to be a ceramic. As you can see right here, this is garbage. Look at this. It's got scratches. And my previous uh, Whirlpool was a 95, actually a 2005 um, old stove. And it was also electric and it had no scratches. And I had that stove here for about maybe almost 15 years into I replaced it with the new Whirlpool, which is garbage, okay? Don't pay, don't overpay for these new appliances. They're not made as before. They're made of cheap parts made from China. And so anyway, so let me get to the microwave. The microwave, uh, sometimes for some reason, the touchscreen goes black, as you can see right here. It's not responsive to the power, to the settings, the light, it's not responsive. You go open it, it has power inside, but the LCD goes unresponsive. So um, in order to clear this, you have to actually go up there and unplug the microwave in order to get it back to work. And I'm telling you, I've been having this issue since I bought this microwave. And like I said, the stove, the glass is not ceramic, it's, it's glass, and it scratches easily, and it's hard to keep clean. All right, so let's unplug it. One second, plug it back in. Okay, now it's gonna power cycle. It's gonna do a reboot. There's a reboot. You can see it. Okay, so now updates. Skip it. I'm going to skip it. So there you have it. So that's how you actually fix your stuck screen on your Whirlpool microwave touchscreen version just unplug it and plug it back in when you see the black screen and i'm telling you man whirlpool i don't know what they're done they haven't fixed the issue i think this is just a hardware issue on these devices i will no longer buy another whirlpool again in my life because so many issues i mean i spent maybe like two grand on these two parts right here and also have a a Whirlpool three four door fridge. So there you have it. To fix the microwave issues, just click, just unplug it from the outlet and plug it back in. Thanks for watching.